Hello, Capricorn. All right, so I was told to use this deck to start your reading. So what is it that you would like Capricorn to know? Okay, someone's telling you it's just so complicated. One more. So we'll see what shows up in your reading. And I have emotional baggage. All right, so this separation will soon be over. So they're explaining to you what's going on, why, they are, why they're keeping their distance, not communicating. Let's see, what is going on for Capricorn? Okay, Wheel of Fortune. Oh my goodness, okay. Five of Coins. Okay, so I think this is a person. They don't know what to say or they just, obviously they're just, they're having a rough time I get right now. I don't feel like this is your energy. I feel like they're keeping themselves out in the cold. Yes, you may feel lonely also, but what else is going on with this person? Oh, I pulled two. Three of Cups and Justice. Three of Coins. Interesting. Strength card and we have the Page of Coin, the Longing card. Under the deck is the Eight of Cups, letting something go and walking away. So this person might be in another, might be in a third party. Doesn't have to be, could be friends, could be family, could be drinking, could be other things going on here, but justice for three of cups. So this person, if, if it's not a third person involved in your reading, it could be like excessive drinking, partying or something like that, because I get like the three of cups is not a good thing because it's saying justice. I don't know if that's you You're thinking about the past. So... Your person is, is they're missing you, but at the same time, it's like they're just like worried about themselves, worried about what's going on in their life. Like they're down on themselves. I'm sorry, I'm trying to feel the feeling so I can articulate it. I can feel it, but it's like they're really down on themselves. This person may be dealing with depression. They feel really low. Like they have low self-esteem right now, Capricorn. They just feel like they really screwed things up. What is this five of coins? Yeah, I think your person, if there's something they did, maybe with another, you know, third party, or they have an addiction. Maybe they're using drinking or drugs or other things to cover their, to mask their feelings. But they're in a bad place right now. So this could be, again, something they need to go through, a dark night of the soul, you know, a reawakening. So this is probably something that's meant to be so that they'll come back a whole person that they can, you know, they need to work on themselves. So I'm trying to say out in the cold, but they love you and they feel very, yeah, the 10 of wands is like a burden to me. A lot of times carrying a big burden, but they're coming to the end of this period in their life with the 10 of wands, the six of cups. I feel like they think about you in the past. They think about the two of you being together. I feel like they long for you because that is my page of coin energy. So what is this three of coins? They feel guilty, Spirit is saying. I don't know if I said that already, but victory, four of wands, two of swords, the three of wands. I feel like this person's rebuilding themselves. I feel like every day the two of you are apart, this person is becoming stronger, both mentally and physically. They could be working also on, if it's a money situation, a business, if they lost money, this person may have lost a lot of money gambling or something along that line. If this person, like like let's say they had a business and with COVID, it ruined the business and they've been really feeling, guilt, not guilty, but they feel bad. They feel like, wow, they screwed up. Like what a loser. I'm, I'm getting what they're saying. I don't, I'm not calling them that. I'm just trying to go into their energy. It would help me just describe what I'm feeling better. But um. They just feel really down on themselves. Like they screwed things up. Like you won't accept them back. You won't love them because they screwed stuff up and they really love you and they want to impress you and they want you to think highly of them, Capricorn, but how they've been acting or what they did or, you know, just, they want to make things better. They want to work on things with three of coins and come back to you like a better person, a whole person. What is the strength card? It's because this is the hidden. This can also be the challenge. I guess this person is definitely has a bad habit, has like a, like a drinking addiction and they drink a lot and act foolish or, so they may be in recovery. They may be detoxing for some of you. Something along that line. <clears throat> what is this page of coin? They may be embarrassed for their actions is also what I'm hearing. Walking away, not sure what to do. Your person, again, is just kind of afraid to afraid to reach out 
See, your person's just all over the place. It's kind of a weird, messy reading. And that's kind of how this person feels. Like they don't know what to say. They want to talk to you. They think about you, but they don't know how to describe what they're feeling. They don't know exactly, you know, what to tell you at this point is what I'm getting here. This is the, it's just so complicated card. Like they just, they feel like they don't know how to articulate things to you. And then they get frustrated. They're confused. Okay, what, what what would this person say to Capricorn? Allow me to work on, my, on me so I can work on us. And that's exactly what this whole reading is saying to me. This person is in a space of healing, self-help, working on themselves, working on their shadow side. I feel like a fool for losing you. See, I don't think this is a good fool. I think this is a fool who really screwed up. I feel like this person is just beating themselves up on a daily basis for what they did how they treated you, uh, what they said. I'm scared you will not accept me now. That's what I'm seeing here. They want to walk away. They want to come towards you, but they're just afraid. Will Capricorn still love them? Will you give them another chance? And one more, please. I'm a, my pride and ego led us astray. So again, I feel like there's something here. Like if it doesn't have to be a third party, it doesn't have to be an addiction, but it's definitely something where this person's like, oh, I can handle it. They like kind of made a fool of themselves. Like, they went too big. Maybe they had good intentions, but it just, yeah, I'm getting this person very prideful, thinks everyone thinks they're hot. Everyone likes them. They could do no wrong. And this was a big ego trip for them. This was a big like fall for them. And it was meant to happen because this person just, yeah, too much. Like this is like emperor energy in reverse, where it's like it's all about them and no one else matters and they think they know everything and they can control everything and people and, and you know it. This was a huge wake-up call for them and it was meant to happen. It's humbled them. Thank you, Spirit. It's been very humbling and it's what they needed is what Spirit is saying. Wow. What is this nine of swords? Let me go back one more. They're hoping that you'll forgive them. They're hoping that you will accept them back, that they can heal, that you guys can heal the situation. They're looking out to the future with you. I guess definitely there could be three day, three week, probably more like three weeks. So somewhere middle of May um, where they will, will return. Threes are very strong in your reading. So I'm seeing that's probably a timeline. It could be three months, but they want to move forward. They want to move on. This seems like it's kind of a slow transition. Okay, Spirit, what do you want me to... Okay, they, they said to go to this one for you guys, Capricorn. What is happening here? They're working on their own stability, palm tree. So stability, growth, endurance, heart with the key. And sunglasses, they are watching you. <clears throat> they need to put other people first is what Spirit's telling me. They need to, again, look at things. They need empathy. They need to learn empathy is one thing that they're working on. So they're doing a lot of shadow work right now that they are becoming stronger. They do realize that you are the one that holds the key to their heart. Okay. So it's a process they're saying it's all, this is all, this is how it's meant to be. Yeah. It's like you guys manifested the 10 of cups together. You guys had it all, but then they just up and walked away. Maybe they left and you don't even really understand why or what happened there. Who did I just do? Sagittarius had similar energy in their reading. So, but their person wanted to race back in, wanted to show up without calling or texting. What does spirit want you to know, Capricorn? In closing here, attraction, number 44. Under the deck is release. I feel like this is a lot of emotional release, maybe for them, not you, but there's still an attraction between the two of you. And what does this person want to say to Capricorn? this deck okay they admire you i'm sorry the cards are falling there we go what else i don't want to let you go and i'm understanding our connection so they're waking up so i miss seeing you this was a much needed separation this is much needed healing for this person so that when you come back together there's more of a give and take like a six of coins like there's more balance because i feel like this relationship was all about them and their needs and not about you capricorn so i'm gonna leave it here you guys have a great week